Hey guys, it's your boy Keyless Dragon Ball back again with another video. Do you guys know why we're here? We're here? I know I'm really, really late on this video, but also, but also before we get started with the video, guys, make sure you guys watch. Make sure you guys watch until the um guys watch the entire video. Watch until the end because I have some important information. I have some important. Uh, I have some important information to show you guys about the brand new training mode that is being added to this game tomorrow. If you guys want to find out, if you guys want to know information about the training mode, you guys have to watch until the end of the video, okay? So the so what are we here to do? Well, if you guys don't know, they had an update. I think a day or two ago, a couple of days ago, I think, or whatever. Basically, they added the hyperbolic time chamber. Now, right now I'm in a private server. Um, if you, you know, again, um, the hyperbolic time chamber is a really good, it's the current best way to level up. I say current best way because I think training mode is going to be a be even better way of leveling up, which we'll go into, we'll go, we'll go into that at the end of the video. So make sure you guys watch till the end of the video. Make sure you guys do subscribe and leave a like on this channel and also comment as well. So if you guys want, so here's how you take full advantage of the hyperbolic time, time chamber. What you want to do. Is you want when you when you click yes he says would you like to enter see where it says yes yes private no you want to click yes private the problem with going in a regular non-private time, time chamber server in a way is that you have a lot of people in there so they're gonna be all the dummies are gonna be used up and everything and you have to wait your turn it's just not efficient but going in going into a private one it's only you in there so you can like I was like in just one hour. I was at, uh, with my other, my, with my, with my second Saiyan, second um, Saiyan character, within one hour, I was able to go from level 50 something to like 60, and and and, and again, in less than an hour, right? I'm actually on, I, I did it yesterday. Yesterday, in an hour, I was able to go from level like 60 to level 71. Like, bruh, it works. All right. However, here that is not all. So when you're going to fight these dummies, here's what you want to do. So if I can say, but I'm level, my character here is level 55. Now, if I go and fight with my base form, it would just take forever. There is a shortcut, almost like a short, not a shortcut, but kind of like a shortcut. Um, it's not really a shortcut, shortcut, but what you want to do is, if it doesn't matter what race you are, if you're a Saiyan, Frost Demon, or Alcrosian. Or a alien, your um, or a bio android, android doesn't have half, half breed saying whatever. What I want you to do is go to your level 50 transformation. So I'm gonna go super saiyan. Okay, let me turn the sound up too. I'm sorry, guys. Now, when you go super saiyan, I want you guys to charge up to maximum power. Listen to me. This, I'm trying, I'm showing you guys how you take full advantage of the hyperbolic time chamber. Now this works with both key builds and melee builds. This character here I'm using is a melee build, so. All right. Now once you fully charge up, we're not done yet. What you guys need to do is click Kaioken. I want you to stack every single Kaioken, right? So I want you to go through all the Kaiokens. So then you're thinking, Nate, why did I do this? Well, if you go to my power level, it's 1,869, so it boosts my power level up pretty well. The reason you want to do this is that when you go to fight a dummy, you see how fast I'm taking them out? See how fast that was? Imagine now, imagine doing multiple dummies and, and basically taking them out that quickly. You're going to level up a lot faster in a much shorter amount of span of time. Look at that. I just took two down. And look, look how my EXP bar. Like, it's that easy. It really is that easy. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep going. Oopsies, they're not going to do that. Let's go to this one. Again, you get the you get all the dummies all to yourself, all all to you. You don't have to share it with other other players. It's all for you. 
Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look how look how easily and quickly I'm taking these dummies out. And look, look how fast I'm getting EXP. Look at it, ready? See how fast I'm gaining EXP, guys? See how fast I'm gaining EXP? Uh oh. Oh no. Oh, come on. Really? I'm sorry, guys. Ugh. Really? The information I told you guys about that you guys need to watch until the end of the video for. So I'm gonna read what he says. 1v1 battle match. So this is gonna be a, basically this is gonna be some kind of a mode. This will actually be a 1v1 battle match mode. This is again, I I I said this many times before. One of the weaknesses of DBOG is PvP. Their PvP kind of sucks. This Dragon Super 3 is gonna have a much better PvP. 1v1 battle match and training mode is being released tomorrow. Now, make sure you guys really listen to, to the, uh, make sure you guys really listen to the words coming out of my mouth. This is very important information right here. Gaining EXP from training mode will be a lot more faster than the hyperbolic time chamber from Earth. Now listen to this. This, this next line is really, really important. Pay attention. On training mode, Using the hyperbolic time people map will be the fastest, the fastest ways to gain EXP. So he's he's literally give, telling you guys the fastest method from DB Dev himself. He says also because of the long wait for training mode, the cost will be 100 zenny to enter every day for a month. Basically, 9% off. And also, levels do not reset when you change your race. LOL. All right. So there you go. That is important information you guys need to know. I've been making videos on it. I'm making. I'll be making videos on the training mode. Don't worry. I got you guys. And hope you guys. Enjoyed, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please leave a like. Please comment. Please share this video out. And, and let's try to get this channel to like a hundred subs. We got it. We're at like sixty some subs. Let's get to a hundred subs. We can do it. I know y'all can do it. I know it. I believe in all of you. Let's get it done. See you guys in the next video. Peace, guys.